Fertilization in mammals. Step one, contact. The sperm migrates through the coat of follicle cells and binds to receptor molecules in the zona pellucida of the egg. And then in the next video, it will show the receptor molecules. Step two. Step two, acrosomal reaction. This binding induces the acrosomal reaction in which the sperm releases digestive enzymes into the zona pellucida. Step three, growth of acrosomal reaction. With the help of these hydrolytic enzymes, the sperm reaches the plasma membrane of the egg and membrane proteins of the sperm binds to receptors on the egg membrane. Step four, fusion of plasma membrane. The plasma membranes fuse, making it possible for the contents of the sperm cell to enter the egg. Step five, cortical reaction. Enzymes released during the egg's cortical reaction harden the zona pellucida, which now functions as a block to polyspermy, which is basically to make sure that no other sperm enters the egg and only one does. This is the acrosomal and cortical reactions during sea urchin fertilization. Step one is contact, where the egg and sperm jelly coat come together. Step two is the acrosomal reaction, where the hydrolytic enzymes are released from the acrosome, and they digest the jelly coat so that the actin can connect with the receptor molecules. Step three is the acrosomal process extends through the jelly coat. The acrosomal process is the actin filaments. And the binds to the receptors in the egg vitellin layer. Step four, the uh, plasma membranes of the sperm and egg fuse. Step five, the sperm nucleus enters the cytoplasm of the egg. Fusion of the gamete membranes trigger an electrical change in the plasma membrane. And this act this acts as a block to polyspermy. This is the fast block to polyspermy. And the cortical reaction, the cortical granules in the egg fuse with the plasma membrane and discharge enzymes into the macromolecules that se separate the vitellin layer from the plasma membrane and harden it. This is the slow block to polyspermy.